Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. As discussed earlier, the quick edit mode has far fewer features than expert edit mode. There are noticeable differences between the two modes. In quick edit mode, the toolbox limits the available tools. The only tools provided are the zoom tool, the hand tool, the selection tools, the red eye removal tool, the whiten teeth tool, the straighten tool, the text tools, the healing brush tools, the crop tool, and the move tool. These tools, however, work the same way in both edit modes when performing manual fixes. Also note that when you are in quick edit mode, several commands are no longer available in the menu bar. These commands appear grayed out within the menu bar to indicate that they cannot be selected. In addition, the panel bin changes to display different quick fix edits that are used to change image elements such as lighting, color, and sharpness. The other panels from expert edit mode are not available. To apply one of the quick fix edits shown in the panel bin, click the small downward pointing arrow next to the name of the fix, like smart fix for example. Then use the buttons, sliders, and other available controls for that fix to make your changes. If you use the sliders and controls, you have more control over the outcome. However, you can click the auto button to automatically apply a quick fix to an image and let elements do the work for you. For most small fixes, this will work fine, but for greater precision, use the sliders. To switch back to expert edit mode, simply click the expert button in the shortcuts bar. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.